Hello, welcome to Back to School Night. Thank you, parents, for coming and checking out my slide deck. Okay, here we go. So this is the translation information you might need. You can pause this and get any information off of this that you might need for translation. I am Mr. Lines. This is the introduction to engineering class that you're Children have come home and told you so much about, I'm sure. And this year I am teaching exclusively the sixth grade. Here's a little bit about me. I grew up right here in Fairfax County, as a matter of fact, right in Annandale in the 22003 zip code. I went to Canterbury Woods Elementary, and then I went to Lake Braddock high school or secondary school, and then I went to George Mason, and in 99, I got my master's from Virginia Tech down in Falls Church. I've been married for quite a while. I've been working here for 30 years, just to let you know. So I've been here for quite some time. Could be my last year. I have two children. Both of them are already finished with college, which is great, and I enjoy doing lots of outdoor activities and also, of course, building things. These are some pictures of things that I like to do, and my children, and my wife. Okay, teaching philosophy. I believe that students learn best when they are active in a classroom, moving from one learning station to another. And that's kind of what we do in here. We pretty much come in, we follow some goals, and we try and complete each portion of uh, the project that we're building. So what can you expect in my class? Well, students are going to be introduced to units that build on each other from the design to the materials fabrication to evaluating solutions that we create. Curriculum. Here's what they will be learning this year. We'll start off with measurement, then we'll go into design communication, which is the most important because that we have design in every other unit. Then we'll move into structures where we learn about structures and the and the four types of stress that actually cause structural failure and we'll build a tower and test it for strength we'll build some model rockets and we'll go launch those uh, in transportation systems we'll build a kind of like a pinewood derby car a gravity race car and we'll do a medieval engineering unit which is a siege machine each student will build uh, their own siege machine which is pretty fun they like doing that that's very open-ended and we also, if we have time, we'll do, we'll build a model of a glider and discuss some flight. All right, this class is a project-based learning experience. So each unit generally has a project that they're going to build, which is the fun part. But there's also some written activities that they have to do. There's portfolios. We do some presentations. So that's usually where if their grade isn't quite up to par. That's usually where something went wrong. Because almost every kid wants to make a, a model rocket, but not everybody wants to complete all the paperwork that goes along with it. And that's that's turned in in the portfolio at the end of each unit. Uh, so that's usually what the problem is. But if you have any any problems, I do stay after school on Wednesdays if the student lets me know. Okay, I just don't stay after school and just sit here. If, they, if somebody needs help, I can stay after school on Wednesdays. Uh, also, I have an email address if you have any questions. That's the best address right there if you need to reach me. It's also on the uh, website for the school. This is some information about supporting your child, which is in every slide deck that you've seen today. And there is a $20 lab fee for consumables. I always get some questions about this, but the county does not buy things like rocket engines, wheels, wood, metal, hardware things like that. So it's actually a pretty good deal. If you went up to buy a rocket kit up at Total Crafts or MJ Designs or something like that, it would uh, probably cost you 20 bucks just to get the rocket kit. They're getting race car, towers, uh, airplanes, all kinds of things. And they get to use all this cool equipment behind me. All right. We're looking great here. So we're going to move on and enjoy the rest of your slide decks. Thank you.